please subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. Hello everyone, I am traveling. I'm in Franklin, Tennessee today, running around planning for a party and I happened upon this wonderful shop. It is called the Painted Tree Marketplace and I understand it's got some boutiques inside. So let's pop in and see what they've got. They're all about fashion, home decor and more. The Painted Tree Marketplace is a shopping experience like no other. It's a creative community of shops that feature hundreds of local shop owners, boutiques, decorators, artisans, and craftsmen all under one roof. And such a warm welcome. It's a great place to buy gifts and to decorate your home if you're looking to update they have something for everyone and lots of different price points. That's one of the beauties of this place. You could buy something for $5 or a couple of hundred dollars. And it gives you lots of decorating ideas as well. Look at the green artichoke, love the pop of color. And of course the beautiful butterflies and the botanical prints are so soothing and natural. I'm glad that ferns are still popular. I've hosted a couple of parties with the fern theme and it's always well received. And I like how the colors just really relax you and it's not quite the farmhouse look, but it's sort of in between that and a more traditional. And I like how they have framed these in just the glass without the matting. And this embellishment over a lamp, I really like. You could even hang an ornament. It gives me some ideas. Lots of inspirational signs. That would be good for a college kid too, to put in their dorm. Keep everything positive. To love one another. Such a dramatic look with the black and white. You could add pops of color to that. And here's a local artisan, has their work on display. Their gallery. Aren't these lovely? You could build a room around one of these, especially the one with the roses. And I really like this neutral look here. And of course with the roses for $14, you could take that to your local grocery store and have them do a small arrangement. It makes a great gift. And I like that each boutique kind of has their own style. This is the Deep South. That's a pottery company from Mississippi and they create unique and custom pieces. And here you see it's all about Tennessee I wish I could take that home, but I'm flying. And you'll see the three stars in this utensil holder. And if you're wondering what that stands for, it is the TriStar. And it represents the three grand divisions of the state of Tennessee. And that would be East, Middle, and West. And the Nashville area of this shape of the state is considered Middle Tennessee. These are really neat pieces. I can see so many different uses. And there's our TriStar again. Makes a really good gift. And make sure to look up, whether you're in an antique shop or here at the Painted Marketplace, there's so much to see and it can be overwhelming, but I just love their attention to detail. And they do have some vintage items, which pleases me. This is a piece from Copeland Spode. And that's a highly collectible one. And it's up to each vendor. They can bring new items or something that happens to be antique. This kind of has a Mackenzie Childs vibe to it. I love the pineapple. And everything that I've seen today is very high quality, including the silk florals. At first glance, it looks real. And that's a bundle, and I think it's rather affordable for $18.99. And 
And there's so many different pottery vases you could find here. Just put a couple of those bunches in and you've got a great look for your entry table. And I love that, oh happy day. And you know, I'm all about the tulips, so for $12.99, you could even put these in a tulipier and have a more lasting look. So many unique products I'm finding here today. Just when I thought I had already seen it all, I found the Painted Tree Marketplace. Just lovely. And that's a unique piece. Wish I had the right spot for that. Very dramatic. And here I like the use of gold with the green and the natural look. And here we've got some roses that are ready to go. Don't they look real? And more ferns. I'm so glad to still see these. This is a paperback that probably cost 25 cents at Goodwill. And they have added some lace and other embellishments. And for $6, it's a very interesting piece. And I didn't really take too much time to look at the fashion today since we're planning for a party. But I'm definitely going to have to come back here. Got some really unique clothing. It looks very comfortable, perfect for the summer and very on trend and here we've got some tennessee shirts that's again the shape of tennessee fashion with a purpose and the denim look is always nice you can pair that with any kind of printed skirt and very kind of boho chic i like the vibe here in nashville i run a tight shipwreck i think i need this in every color i love that that would be a good gift for someone. I think that's really clever. And there we've got the tri-state again, represented on the t-shirt with leopard print, love it. And you see that the shop owners pay a lot of attention to detail and create some really unique and inviting shops. And these statement necklaces, you could even put as part of your decor. Wouldn't that be fun? And napkin rings, I'm always looking for some. In fact, this is on my list right now. I wish I had bought these. The Greek key design. These are classic one-stop shopping. And it's actually harder to find napkin rings than you think. So what a find. I should have bought more. This boutique booth was really interesting. Everything sparkles. Can you imagine these cowboy boots for a baby? $500. They are tricked out with Swarovski crystals. That could be a centerpiece. That's incredible. I wonder if someone were to buy these and wear them to the awards ceremony in Nashville. $1,250. Unfortunately, it's not my size. It's seven and a half and I would need eight and a half. And everything is embellished with Swarovski crystals. I think this is such a neat booth and you really get noticed and they have all the different college teams, pro football, Tennessee Titans is their local NFL team. And we've got the LSU Tigers, Oklahoma State, so many different schools represented. There's Longhorn. And this really makes a great gift too. I love that you can shop here and find something for your home and a gift for someone. Look at all these pretty flowers. I am so ready for spring and summer. This is almost like a cloche, except it's an open air. I love it. Could really display something nice in that. It gives you ideas too to walk through the booths and they do have a few things on clearance that are left over from Easter. So the price is definitely right. Candle holders. And this line I've seen before in a gift boutique. It's the lost and found. I like that a lot. You could put several on a wall and you find so many deer in Tennessee at dusk, especially that's a striking piece it would be great on a table, even for a table setting. And these are great for fall with the pheasants. And they're on sale. Love the colors. You could bring out that green or teal. And I'm all about the flowers today. Look at these. I feel like I'm at a French market. And I like the gingham. It is definitely popular in so many different colors. And the cloches. Love them. I've done some episodes on how to make cloches too. You'll have to check that out. Like the ferns. Just such a nice look. I like to see all the different styles. And of course, who doesn't love a clearance sale? 75% off in this booth. And I immediately found this piece. That is for a single flower. You can place it on a table, add a little bit of water, and put anything from your garden. And this was a unique booth. I love the vibe and how they created the bee honeycomb look. They sell honey and any type of accessory. 
these are vintage aren't those lovely this i think was the bargain i didn't buy it because i'm traveling by plane 5.99 look at that you could fill it with silks this i know is mariposa i know it it's a candy dish mariposa brillante and sure enough that's a company from massachusetts nora fleming is a popular line that you find in some high-end gift stores and they have ceramic and melamine pieces with what they call minis these are attachments that you slip in and then you can change it up for a seasonal look this is the saint jude's piece that uh, proceeds go to help the children's hospital the sand castle so here you put your different mini inside and you change up your whole look it is a brilliant idea love this company nora fleming maybe you can find it at your local gift shop i have quite a few of the bases and lots and lots of the minis and if you know your friend has the collection then you can just buy a new mini love that teal background wall color wouldn't that be pretty in a living room or dining room and of course i'm all about the blue and white love this planter sort of a chinoiserie and look how they've taken these old windows and placed them inside it adds some interest you could even use it as a headboard or behind a headboard here they've just put moss on a platter real easy with the decorative item there's more chinoiserie with the blue and white I just love it I'm definitely planning for my birthday with that look these would be nice in a cloche as well the artificial lemons and sachets that's a great price point the green and white gingham I'm loving it it is definitely back from the 70s and look at these placemats I'm going to build a table in Germany around this I think I'll bring a tablecloth with me and there are even some local loose leaf teas how about that and this caught my eye I love this as a centerpiece maybe on a breakfast table and I think we all need this tea towel hang in there the real housewives of Franklin oh yes well you know we're in the Nashville area such interesting art there's some collegiate and the quilts you know quilts are really making a comeback you see them at estate sales and they go quickly and here there's so much love that's gone into these these are not made in china this is made by a local artist 175 is very fair for a quilt and they have some beautiful ones for little girls and so many themes represented and the squares are made and then they're stitched together and they really do keep you warm i've had some old quilts that are wonderful love these colors with the chartreuse and the navy i think i should have bought a quilt i think next time i'll drive so that i can fill my car up again the prices are really good on these look at those pillows aren't they neat and i didn't realize this about the painted tree marketplace but they're actually represented in seven different states You know, I'm all about the vintage linens. I was so pleased to find this particular booth. And look at these napkins. Wouldn't they be perfect for a luncheon or tea time? With the tatting. 10 napkins for $28. And these are on sale too. This was the find of the day. I am so happy with these. And even if I didn't want to keep them, I could put them in a pretty box, tie it with ribbon and give it as a gift. And someone would be oh so pleased to receive them. And the lemons, I'm loving that with the blue background. I happen to really enjoy lemons for $12.95 and 20% off. This has been hand embroidered and it's just four, but I can invite three girlfriends and have a nice luncheon. And love pictures i featured these in a previous segment there's so many different uses you'll have to check it out and who doesn't need a stone or a pitcher you could fill it with flowers and the prices are really good very neutral colors too and they do a good job of displaying them on this antique rack and i think the prices are really good this looks like it's from the 50s for 21 dollars. this has been hand embroidered just so many options here that are affordable and very practical that's a beautiful hand embroidered towel love it i should have bought that for my friend and here we've got some doilies many of these are hand crocheted 
And these are practical to put on maybe a bedside table or as a table centerpiece, especially if you're not serving food. And they do cover up a silver tray quite nicely and it serves two purposes. It keeps the moisture off of your tray if you have something like condensation from a drink and it covers up any blemishes. Look at this hand tatting. This one I think is an older piece while this is a newer one. I just love the feel of the old cotton and linen. And what a great housewarming or hostess gift this would be for $7. And handkerchiefs are neat too. Definitely coming back. I love the brass candlesticks. And they have handbags too for a night out in Nashville. And some minks. I love how they display everything. It's very inviting. And I, clutches are my absolute favorite. This is a nice table topper. I love square toppers. And handkerchiefs, I see that more and more ladies are carrying these in their handbags, trying to you know, reduce and reuse. They're very practical and you can display them in a handkerchief vase or maybe on a tray. Some beautiful edging on these. The prices are right. And now it's time to check out we found a few treasures here are those napkins the mariposa candy dish that you can just put anything in and the lemon napkins are fabulous love these i'm so glad that i found this wonderful painted tree boutiques in a strip center of all places didn't know what to expect i'm so glad that i was able to find some vintage treasures certainly didn't expect that they have amazing booths here with anything you could ever imagine for home decor and great gift items isn't this a beautiful blue and white planter i just love it and i'm finding all kinds of treasures this ornamental piece i have a similar item at home and i'm thinking this would be great for my tablescape that i'm working on that i will feature soon thanks again for joining lady mary beth elevate your every day with treasures thanks for joining lady mary beth please hit like and subscribe i hope to see you next time for more lifestyle tips